Here's a video presentation of the tables countdown software that I use in my class uh, very regularly. There are three files that come with the download. This first file here is the Mac application, so it can be run on a Macintosh computer. This one here is a um, application to run on the PC. It's an executable file, which means that Flash Player is built into it. And this is what they call the SWF file, which can run inside um, Notebook, which is interactive whiteboard software. Let's just have a look at the, um, at the software. And I'll just close up the file. All right, now it can be enlarged and, or scaled to whatever size that you want. So it'll fit full screen on an interactive whiteboard if you if you choose so and the concept is very very straightforward um, it's just a very simple program student presses the start button and can click in the answers and see how many they can get right in the time that's given there's 30 seconds i'll just reset that 30 seconds altogether, and students try and see how many they can uh, get correct the score down here is just a tally of correct and there is a score that deducts a mark if they're wrong and that's just a bit of fun for students as well. So here we go. 2 times 10 is 20. 2 fours are 8. 6 nines. Let's say that that's 60. And we press enter. That deducts a score. 3 nines are 27. 3 threes are 9. 8 ones are 8. Goes up to the 10 times table. 10 times 10. 4 eights. Uh, let's say a mistake. 20. 5 zeros are 0. 10 sixes are 60. Two tens are 20, six nines are 54, almost finished, and there's a little bit of a pause for the correct answer. Now, um, the software can be put into Notebook as well, which is, or any interactive whiteboard software. I've just put this in already, but I'll just show you how, how easy it is to actually import. Um, if I just cut that now, and I'll just delete this here. I was playing with this earlier. And I go to insert flash file. It will open up the flash file that's there. When I open that, it imports it. Now this can be scaled as well, so that you can actually, if you choose to, uh, let's say something like that, you can take a pen and you can um, write some information on the board if you want to do some other work at some stage. Sorry about that little bit of mess. Okay, so I'll just clear that up now. There we go. All right, so the it's very versatile the software, but above all, just lots and lots of fun.